Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very quick unboxing for you guys. Kind of a point of view situation here. This is the 15 piece Active Brands box from ThreadUp. All the items in here should be in a size medium or close to a size medium. And I wanted to share with you guys what I found in there. I paid 60 bucks for it. I got 15 pieces, so it is $4 per piece. There is my receipt. And I was a little afraid it would be all Old Navy and Champion C9 and then also, you know, like Fabletics without sizes, but it was actually pretty good. So let's get started here. So the first item I'm pulling out, this green sports bra, is actually Fabletics and it does not have a size. So ThreadUp guesstimated that this was a medium, which looks about accurate. Um, I'll measure it, provide measurements compared to other sports bras I have. So that'll definitely get listed. And then this is the first piece that was pretty good. It's an aloe yoga uh, pair of leggings here with this velvet insert. And from what I've seen so far, these come pretty well. It's size medium as promised and I haven't found any flaws yet. But to be honest, I also haven't given them another uh, good look after unboxing this uh, thread up box. Next up, we got this pair of Lululemon pants. You could also already see the logo there before me. Um, I had to look for a while to find the style name, but I think I found it. I think it's the trouser pant. It's something very basic in terms of the name. Uh, it's an older style. I could not find a size dot to save my life. Not sure where it is. It's, it's not in any of these pockets. There's even a hidden pocket that I checked later. I haven't found a size dot, but I would estimate it's probably a six to eight. So as you can see, I'm just looking for, you know, any type of pocket that I could potentially check. Um, there's one in the back that I'm also checking, but yeah, no size dot on these. I will insert a stock photo here, um, but good find. I think overall Lululemon, I'm always happy to find these in my boxes and yeah. This was a decent piece, even though it didn't have a size in it. Okay, next up we got this sort of smoky design um, from Athleta. Also a great, great pair of leggings. I found these already uh, on their website too. They seem to have a little bit of pilling in the crotch area now that I'm looking at the video. Again, I haven't looked all of these over too closely yet, but so far really happy with those brands. Got another pair of Fabletics. Also no size, um, so I'll, I'll measure. I mean, it should be adjacent to a size medium, but the description for this startup box also says that you might receive other sizes. Um, these Fabletics leggings have like a little bit of a faux leather insert there, which makes them a little bit more interesting and hopefully makes it easier to find what style there are. Okay, um, this might be the first item that may or may not be beyond repair. It's an Under Armour um, light pink little zip up um, hoodie here. It is for breast cancer awareness, which uh, it's a shame that it's, it has so many stains on it. Um, I'm turning it over and I just kept finding more and more as I was going along. Uh, I have to just soak it and see if I can get them all out just by soaking and washing it then I'll probably list it but I don't want to spend any additional time just doing a spot treatment on individual stains. Um, Old Navy Active, not super great, but you know what? Old Navy uh, has really been stepping their game up with their Active Wear line and these are high rise, they're a good magenta color. I really like these, I think they're gonna do well. Uh, here we have a Champion Reverse weave and this is a size small so not a size medium but that's fine um, i think somebody cut that off themselves it's kind of like a cropped style i'll have to look it over for stains on my tie dye it we'll see another fabletics sports bra without a size here but kind of like an interesting back situation with the cutout there uh, i might just lot these up honestly they're different styles but who knows? Uh, I think they might do better if I lot them up. This is my favorite find in the whole box. It's another pair of Lululemon leggings with a pristine tag in them. There's the logo. Uh, I haven't found the style yet. They do have a style number um, on the size dot. I just haven't looked it up yet. And honestly, they're in such great condition. I'm not even sure if they've ever been worn. They have a little bit of a surface stain in one area that I'll clean up, um, but I'm really excited for that pair love that periwinkle color too. Uh, here's the Champion C9 as feared, but this is actually a cute piece. It's a, a zip up little jacket here um, with pockets and kind of like almost ribbed inserts there. So 
it's, you know, it's a cute piece. If it was my size, I would keep that probably for myself. But I think I'm probably going to list that, um, we'll see, just for like 15 bucks or so. Uh, this Under Armour looks cute, but just felt very cheap, especially for a pair of compression leggings. But it has kind of like a cute style with that um, blue and white pattern there, that little bit of an accent. So, see. Then we have a pair of, I believe, Nike shorts. Yep. There we are. They seem to be in decent shape. I'll probably run them through the wash. They're kind of like this olive green khaki color. Um, yeah, a little bit oversized almost if you ask me, but I think I'm going to list them as well. Then we have a Nike dry fit, just basic blue t-shirt. Nothing too exciting, but I'll probably list it. I have to see what else I have by Nike that's maybe in a similar style and size and I might just lot these up. Uh, another Nike dry fit, just like a plain crew neck shirt with the swoosh logo here on the chest um, and that is item number 15 so I think really only one item that I potentially would not list based on condition I haven't really found any other flaws just looking them over other than you know not having a size tag or anything like that but I was definitely happy with this box. I thought it was a really solid box. I was excited for the Aloe Yoga, for the Athleta, and the two Lululemon. And I think between all of those, I will make my money back. But you guys let me know what you think down below in the comments. See you soon. Cheers. Cheers.